Hello, and welcome to Reading and Drawing with Coach Ellie. Today, I will be reading a poem from Where the Sidewalk Ends by Shel Silverstein. I used to love these poems as a kid, so hopefully you will too. The poem I'm reading today is called One Inch Tall, and it goes like this. If you were only one inch tall, you'd ride a worm to school. The teardrop of a crying ant would be your swimming pool. A crumb of cake would be a feast, and last you seven days at least. A flea would be a frightening beast if you were one inch tall. If you were only one inch tall, you'd walk beneath the door, and it would take about a month to get down to the store. A bit of fluff would be your bed, you'd swing upon a spider's thread, and wear a thimble on your head if you were one inch tall. You'd surf across the kitchen sink upon a stick of gum. You couldn't hug your mama. You'd just have to hug her thumb. You'd run from people's feet in fright. To move a pen would take all night. This poem took 14 years to write, because I'm just one inch tall. Wasn't that fun? Now for our drawings. Today, I want you to draw what it would be like to be one inch tall. You can either draw yourself really small in a room, or you can draw yourself next to something that would normally be small and is now very, very big. The biggest rule is for you to be creative. For the duration of the video, I will have the poem up on the screen. That way you can look back at it if you need a little help with your inspiration. Now, the only drawing paper I have is super big. so. I'm going to draw a line down the middle of my page. You don't have to do this. Use up as much page space as you need, okay? Let's get started.
ragged in the bones strewn around the room I recall another hazy may take a round in the rain gone hungry for the My camera stopped recording while I was drawing, so unfortunately you can't see how I got to my finished picture. That's okay, though. The man who wrote the poem also drew someone one inch tall. Here's what his picture looks like in the book. It's funny, isn't it? Now this is my picture. I'm a very small stick figure, and that's my cat looking at me. His name is Goliath, or Gogo for short. Here's a picture of him. What does your picture look like? Let us know. Thank you for joining me, and I will see you on Wednesday for yoga.